Rolling. Rolling. Action, please. When I was in high school, when I was about 15, I mostly watched movies and TV, like, for stuff to do. And I realized at one point that there was a person who was in charge of the photography of the show. It just, you know, I figured that out. And I thought, oh man, that would have to be the coolest job ever. Yeah, I didn't know how I was gonna get to where I was gonna go, and I didn't even know where I was going, you know? I just knew I wanted to shoot stuff that was fun and challenging and that people would get to see. It's hard for me to speak to the troubles I've had as a female cinematographer because I've never been a guy. I have lots of friends who are struggling cinematographers, directors, editors, producers, all that. And I see this struggle no matter what gender they are, or how old they are, or what race they are. Everybody has a problem and it's always really hard. A lot of people, there's been so many people that have helped me and inspired me, and this is the kind of business where if there aren't a series of people helping you get to the next level, then you're probably not going to get there. And hopefully when you get to where you think you're going or close to there or along the way, you can help other people because everybody in this business has a dream to do something. and Everybody needs help. So Chicago Fire for me is a big step because I established the look of the show. I've always gone in after the pilot's been shot and the show's been sold and it's gonna happen so everyone's sort of tied into the style of whatever's been established for the show. This is the first show I've done where I shot the pilot. There's a lot of shows shooting here right now. I think there's six television shows this season and I have to say, I know for sure we have the best crew. She's a great boss, she's a good manager, and also she's a very good director of photography. And I like my job. There are such amazing people. There are people who work really hard here. One of the assistant editors from the show sent me a clip reel so I could use it for my website for the Chicago Fire footage. I sat there at my computer and I clicked it and I watched it and it was just scene after scene of all these like explosions and all this smoke filled stuff, guys diving into an icy lake, just amazing stuff and I was just, oh my god, we shot all that? And I just started crying, you know, once again, like sitting at my computer crying. It blew my mind.